Hello, first loves. Welcome in. Surika. Mabuhay. And you are back in the first side with the same outfit <laughs> because it's a film day and I'm unboxing several items, including my Victoria's Secret haul part two. And now it's another Sephora haul. And I'm going to unbox this right now. Without further ado. <laughs> okay, so we do like this. I intentionally did not put on lipsticks because we are going to be swatching some items from here. The boxes of Sephora goes like this. There's like the Sephora iconic logo. And it's a black and white stripes inside. And then there's a paper bag which holds the items that I bought. So grab it. And they're here. <laughs> Okay, so it's like a continuation of my first two Sephora unboxing um, that I have shared to you this month of May 2020 because I have here some items that are also Guerlain <laughs> and then there's um, two more items here that is not Guerlain because you know how I am super addicted with Guerlain. Um, I have here uh, Too Faced and Urban Decay. Okay, so... Take all the items out and here they are. What is up with this other one? Why is it open? Yeah. Okay, then I'm going to start with um, the this I, other items that are not from Guerlain and let's do the Guerlain last. Okay, so I think we are going to start with Urban Decay. So this is my first Urban Decay. Um, liquid lip product, but this is actually called the. Uh, um, I should do like this. And this is called the uh, uh, Urban Decay Hi Fi Shine Ultra Cushion Lip Gloss. So this item is currently on sale on uh, Sephora.se uh, and this is on the shade Gold Mine. I don't know if you could see that, though, because it's very, very reflective. So that and I am going to swatch this one. Okay, let's grab it from here. Okay. Ooh, I like the box. I like that it has this. Are those radios? Yeah, old school radios. There. And then this is the item. So pretty. And I am happy because you could see the shade of the lip gloss in there. I saw all the reviews that I could with this one. Oh my god, it's a very, very pretty packaging. It's very pretty. I did not go to Urban Decay and check this out or swatch it. I just, I just like blind buy it with the help of YouTube. <laughs> so there we have an Urban Decay logo here. And then... Yeah, and then Hi-Fi Shine on the side. So reflective. Okay. Once again, this is in a shade Gold Mine. Okay, so I am going to swatch it on my lips first. And then swatch it on my arm. So exciting. Oh my, let's just talk about this applicator. I think I like this type of applicator. A little longer also okay oh so sparkly I really like like golden um, golden lip glosses because I could put it as a topper I can even wear it alone it oh well, while talking I smelled it it smell minty I never smell any lip product that's so minty yeah it's so minty it's like mint gum. <laughs> yeah, anyway, so let's go ahead and swatch this on my lips. So this is how how my terrible lips look without gloss. <laughs> and then I'm going to do the swatch. Probably going to move closer to you. Ooh. Oh my. Oh 
Oh, wow. Ooh, that's so pretty. That's so pretty. Oh my God, it's even so minty on the lips. It really has mint. Did it even say that anywhere? It has mint. Oh, yeah. Peppermint oil. There on the ingredients, it has peppermint oil. Yeah, no, on all the reviews I saw, nobody's bothered to look at why it's so minty. It's because of the peppermint oil in there. So there, it has a lot more other shades. I hope that I could put it somewhere on the screen. But this is the one that is on sale. They even have another color, which is like a purple one or like a violet. It's, it's violet, not purple. I think I'm going to grab that too. I think I'm going to grab that too. Yes. I'm really happy with this one and I like it. So yes. Oh, if you want, I can go ahead and swatch it also on my arm. So you see how it looks. And it's like so. Shall we repeat it so you see more? And it's like that. It's very, very pretty. Oh my gosh. You're gonna fall in love with this one too. And that's it for this Urban Decay Hi-Fi Shine in Goldmine. Should I put more? Let's see if it's buildable. Hmm. Just a little bit. Alright, so this next one is from Too Faced and this is called Too Faced Rich and Dazzling High Shine Sparkling Lip Gloss. They always want to make the title super long, right? <laughs> and it's in the shade Pretty Penny. So I have seen a lot of reviews about this too because Seriously, before I buy an item, I see all of the reviews, even if they're in a different language. Sometimes it's Russian, it's Vietnamese, it's Chinese, and I do not understand the thing. But I just wanted to see the swatches and how it looks on, on the beautiful YouTubers. <laughs> so yes, there you go. And let's go ahead and check this out. It's on this um, pink box um, for Too Faced. This is how the box looks. So pretty. And then we have the shade over here, which is Pretty Penny. When are we gonna focus? There you go, pretty penny. And I am going to open it. I always open the things from the bottom. <laughs> okay. And here it is. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. You know what? I've been to Sephora so many times before ordering this too. And I kid you not, I, it's still a blind buy. I did not try this. I did not test it even if it's there. So it's that. And I really like this pink packaging. You know how I'm getting crazy about uh, pink, um, pink makeup. And I really like that um, this one has like micro glitters on the cap oh my gosh it's not just like a plain light pink it has some micro glitters on the cap i am not sure if that's being caught by the camera but i know that the camera can catch the uh, pretty micro glitters from this tube for the lips uh lip gloss shade and then um two face right there which is embossed and we have a Too Faced logo right there. And we also have Too Faced logo over here. Yes. Okay, I cannot wait to go ahead and try this on also. Pretty Penny, what is up? Let's see. Okay. So at the moment, uh, my lips still has this sensation of the mint. <laughs> from the Hi-Fi Shine, but I have already removed that. Ooh, clear transparent wand. And the applicator is long. Okay, I like this type of applicator too, yes. That's so pretty. And I'm really into gold um, or, or coppery type of lip glosses i really like this lots of glitters also because they really look good at me <laughs> okay so let's go ahead and try 
Okay, now we have a very, very sweet scent. Oh my gosh, it's like I am uh, explaining a perfume to you, just like what I do in my perfume videos. Yeah. A little bit of vanilla. A lot of vanilla. <laughs> so yes, let's go ahead and try this one then. Okay. Okay, here. I'm gonna go closer. Oh, hmm. wow, this is perfect for every day. Hmm, it's mm. so I grabbed the mirror <laughs> so I can really give you a real first impressions. Oh, okay. Hmm. I cannot help but compare it with the uh, Hi Fi Shine as you saw it earlier, right? Um, it has more glitters on it this is a lot of glitters too but and and much more much more softer on lips um as the urban decay is a little bit more creamier yeah let's let's try and put a little bit more let's see because i did that with the urban decay it will only be fair if i put a little bit more yes so let's go ahead and try Buildable. Yes, it is. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, I really could wear this alone. I, I could wear, wear it even not as a topper, just like a regular lip gloss. Um, probably could just put um, a lip liner underneath or a lip balm instead. Oh, this is so nice. Hmm. I like it. I like this one. Yeah, and, and let's go ahead and do a hand swatch also. So, Too Faced in Pretty Penny. One swatch. And let's do another one but as you see it has it's more sheer that's the correct word yes elizabeth um the two-faced one is more sheer than the urban decay which is packed with oof, everything in there i like them both oh my gosh i'm so happy that i get to have them now i feel like i wanted to collect um gold or coppery type of lip glosses i actually have one limited edition from that was just given to me and it was from kylie cosmetics and i probably could um show that to you next time if i grab or if i was able to have some more of this type of lip glosses with lots of glitters and shimmers then i am going to do like um a comparison amongst all of them and their formulation. So that's that, and then let's go ahead and proceed to the Guerlain part. So you all know that I am a sucker for Guerlain Rouge G, and I am trying to collect them all, I kid you not. I have more of the cases than the lipsticks. I, I only have like three. There's three here that I am going to add to the collection. So I am going to show them to you. So this is the first one over here. And um, this is called um, Hype Purple. This is how it looks from the box. Hype Purple. So this, um, I'm just really happy that, that Sephora dropped the price for this on the website. But it's not the same price on the Sephora stores. Because I tried to check if Gothenburg or our Sephora store have dropped the price too. But no, they didn't. So it's like this and it's color purple and it's like this uh, faux leather that's how it is and then um as i showed you on a previous video how it works is that it opens and then there's a, two mirrors here which is perfect right because if you're doing lip swatches you don't need to grab um mirror anymore you have it right away <laughs> So that's that. I'm not gonna open the other ones anymore. Just gonna show you the colors like this, right? Because at, at least you have an idea on how they are. But I'm gonna show you um, how it works. 
So I'm gonna grab one of my Guerlain Rouge G lipsticks right here, which you should you can buy separately before you could buy them together. But it's only just the uh, regular or the original Guerlain Rouge G mirror case. So this is the lipstick. That's a good thing because if you run out of um, the lipstick, you can just buy a refill. And then you can mix and match depending on your mood, on your outfit, on the occasion. And then you can just grab your favorite case. So this is how it works. So that's the lipstick. And then it has um, a G here, which is the logo, which is going to hold the mirror in place. So it doesn't open because at the moment, it's being held by the sticker, right? But normally, it will be like that. So if you put on the lipstick, this one... This part is going to hold it and then that's how it is that's how it looks and then it has of course the Guerlain logo in the middle so that's the first one and that's the high purple and then I am going to share you let's see the other ones this one is the one that I really wanted to have because it's red um, but there's one, one more, it's like something with the jungle um, that I'm trying to get to, but it's mostly sold out. But yeah, it you could still buy it though. So this is the other one in red with a different texture. Very, very pretty. It's going to show you how it looks with the lipstick on. And that's how it looks. It's a very nice bullet, it's very weighty, it's very pretty. And I am going to allot a separate video and showing all of you guys um, how the uh, wear cases works and swatches and my entire collection of them. But I'm gonna show you the last one on this haul. Remember I have five items, so this is one last. It's like a black marble. There you go. Very, very pretty. And I have that in white too. So that's it. And that's for all <laughs> for my Sephora unboxing for today. Two lip glosses and then three cases to add to my collection. And I hope that you like this video. I will do a lot more videos of lip products, my collection, showing you swatches, lip swatches, and hand swatches. And just um, if you like this type of content, uh, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I have lots of um, things to offer you guys. I also have some jewelry videos, Pandora, makeups, um, perfumes, and more. See you on my next one. And remember to stay fierce and fly high.